What I'm going to do today is try and bring my patio back to life. It's very old and drab looking. It's about 30 years and the cement slabs look really bad. I'm trying various methods of cleaning. Yeah, so I'm going to put the bleach on these four tiles here and see what happens. I'm going to leave it for 15 minutes. So this is after um, 20 minutes. I'm just giving it a wash with water. So let's see what we got here. It's cleaner. There's no doubt about that. Now as you can see, if you look over here, to this side, it's dirty. And then you come along to the one I used the bleach on. But my problems with it is, let me go and zoom in on this. Down in here you still have these black spots, mold spots, which I really don't like and it didn't remove them. And I want those to go. So, I'm most likely going to keep grinding like I am over here. Let's zoom out. I'm most likely keep grinding like I am here. You can see the dirt and you can see the new diamond ground blade with a four and a half inch on a angle grinder. I like that and then I can bleach and get the little spots out of the, you know, where I miss cleaning. I can get them out with a bit of bleach afterwards. I think it'll work quite well. So as you can see it's cleaning up. I'm finished for the day. It's hard work. I've got about this half of the clean done. So I have that clean. I've done another section of it. So it's going really slow. I've taken about three and a half hours, four hours to do this and it's back breaking and I need a break but I will get it done section by section so here you can see this here is the ground and that's dry and that's wet there's the dry elements of it and over here you can see where I bleached and that's fairly dry and over another stair it's wet so that's what, what the look I have now and if I pan over here slowly you can see where I've cleaned the whole deck and it's drying out. I'll just show you one tile that should be enough for you or just a little bit. This is a diamond head and you can see it's stepped down here. That's how far I'm in. I'm about halfway. As you can see, this is cleaned up quite nicely up in here. And I still have all this half deck to do. So at the moment, I'm using the diamond head on the grinder and I'm grinding away. It's slow, but I will get there. And I find I leave mist patches now and then and I'm realizing if I wash that with bleach it looks pretty good. So that's the way I'm leaning towards doing this patio to make it look brand new or close to new again. Well I got rained out today so there won't be much done. I'm getting, I'm over halfway now so we're getting there. Yeah, it stopped raining, and so away up in here, from just above the flower pot there in the corner, I went up and over and out. So I've got another eighth of it done. So we're getting there. You do get a little blemish in them, but as you can see, that goes one way, and this goes another way because I ground different angles, and that helps the look. 
Might have some small touch-ups, but on the whole, it looks pretty good. So here it is. The deck complete. Took me a bit, but you know, I spent about eight to ten days doing it. Out of three or four hours a day, but I got it done. It was well worth it because it looks more modern and clean now. And you know it if you want to be a perfectionist, you'd have to go over this with another, if you wanted it smooth, you'd have to go over it with another stone and then another stone to keep it to get it really cement smooth. But I don't want that. I want this rough look a little. And you know, I changed directions a bit while I was grinding so that it wouldn't all have the same patterns. And it turned out really well. And you know, I took it from you know 30 years old to pretty new again. So I'm quite happy with this. So my patio's done. So there you go. That's how I did my patio. I wish you luck with yours.